Hello Uplanders, I'm YK2012, founder of the Upland Guide. In this video, I'm going to show you mistakes that people have made that have cost them hundreds, if not thousands of dollars. So it's really important to take a look at what I'm going to show you and the tips that I'm going to give you to prevent this from happening to you. One of the best things about Upland is that this is a play-to-earn game. So this actually means that you can earn while playing. There are many ways of doing that, but one of them is by selling your properties. After you buy a property for UPEX, you are able to sell it for more UPEX, or you're able to sell it for US dollars. And that is something that attracts many people to this game. If I wanted to list a property for US dollars, I would go here and click sell. You always have the opportunity to sell for UPEX, but if you want to sell for US dollars, you have to be using the browser version of the game and not the phone app. You also would have have to uh, completed the KYC process in order to be able to sell properties for US dollars. So now that I've chosen to sell, and let's say I want to sell this property for $500. I'm going to want to come here and click on the US dollars button. There are many, many people who come and click on this UPEX button by mistake. If I wanted to sell for 500 US dollars and I went here to UPEX and I put in 500, I'm actually going to be selling this property for 500 UPEX, not 500 dollars. This is where I see in the Discord that there are so many people who say that they've made this mistake of listing a property for UPEX instead of dollars and they essentially practically gave this away for free and someone will buy this property immediately there are people who use bots to track property listings using a bot to purchase a property is against the rules but there are lots of people who track prices and they know how to receive a notification if they see anything under a certain price. So 500 UPEX is practically free. So these players who are just waiting for these opportunities, they're going to go ahead and purchase this property even before you have an opportunity to realize you made a mistake. What can you actually do to help yourself not make this mistake? So I'm going to show you here, if you go into the US dollars tab, it says offer type in US dollars. And if I wanted to list for 500, I will see the dollar sign here. And again, if I go back into the UPEX and I put in 500, I do not see that it is $500. In fact, it says allow offers for UPEX or property. So if I do list this for whatever price, I can enable people the ability to offer me a different price or to offer me a trade for a property. So I can toggle those on and off, but it doesn't really have any effect on the, uh, the price here. But if I go back into dollars, let's say I wanted to sell it for 500, what I can actually do, and this is something that really helps me, I will put it in for not $500, but $499.99. So if you're selling for US dollars, you can actually sell for a fraction of a dollar. And if I wanted to sell for UPEX, I would not be able to sell for $499. And I'm trying to put the decimal place in and it will not let me. So if you're ever trying to sell something for US dollars, try and sell it not for a rounded number but for a fraction. Hopefully this will help you remember that you are in fact in the right screen. It's super important to always pay attention to this. You do not want to make this mistake and this goes for a lot of things. Double check, read everything that you see on the card, think twice before you uh, click the OK button, whether someone is, is offering you a trade and you want to accept or decline it, just pause before you do it, think twice, read the words, and that can prevent you from making a, a huge mistake because once something is sold, it's not reversible. 
what's done is done. So it's extremely important to pay attention to these things. And I hope that this tip will help to remind you in the future to pay attention to this and not to make this mistake that many, many other players have done. Please leave us any comments, like this video, and don't forget to subscribe.